the next question is to hold the belief that all the companions will enter paradise eventually. However, uh, the odd few, some of them will be punished in Jahannam first before entering paradise. Is this a belief of the Ahlul Sunnah? No, because look, with this belief, firstly, for someone to say some of them will be punished in Jahannam, they need a Nas. There is no such Nas. There is no such Nas in Quran and Sunnah. In fact, it's the opposite. Every Sahabi shall enter paradise without entering hell. Allah. Yes, this is the correct Allah. position. The issue is that every Sahabi, look, my position on this is every Sahabi is also mahfuz. And even if a sin does occur, they are punished on earth or they do tawbah. On earth. There is no dalil that a Sahabi did a sin and was musir on the sin. They all did tawbah, like the man he committed adultery. He went to the Prophet ﷺ and said, I done adultery, he was punished on earth. The Sahabi was drunk and they wanted to curse him. And the Prophet ﷺ said he loves Allah and his messenger and then he was punished on earth. No Sahabi commits a sin and then is musir on the sin. They all do tawbah, they all are mahfuz, they all are protected and they all enter paradise. If you want to go into a Sheikh Muhyiddin ibn Arabi and, and Futuhat al makiyah that's a different issue. What he says regarding the Ummah of the Prophet never mind Allah. any Sahabi.